Xbox Tuesday. Idol takes Chicago by storm. Yo! Are we gonna find the next idol here in this group today? And with music superstar Shania Twain as guest judge. Oh yeah! There's just one word to sum it up. It's a yes. <laughs> oh my god! They all start somewhere. American Idol. Tuesday at 7 on Fox Chicago. And as our time here in Chicago comes to a close, the last few hopefuls vie for a golden ticket of their own. And baby, you're all that I want When you're lying here in my arms I'm finding it hard to believe We're in heaven I'm gonna pass. I say yes. I'm gonna say yes. I'll give you one more shot. I'm gonna say yes. Welcome to Hollywood. And finally, finally. Oh! See you in Hollywood. All right, Amy, later, American Idol gave him a golden ticket to Hollywood, but then it was taken away. What went wrong for that contestant after 9.30 right here on Fox Chicago News? Also, I had American Idol heartbreak. Why this Chicago singer got a chance, then lost his chance to go to Hollywood. Tonight, the Chicago edition for American Idol aired right here on Fox Chicago. And as we know, this kind of thing, <laughs> the bad stuff, is, all, is uh, often very fun to watch with a crowd, especially. Entertainment reporter Bill Zwecker is here to give us an example. That's right. It's always good to watch us with a crowd. And of course, uh, the American Idol folks organize stuff around the country. Now, while we saw plenty of Idol hopefuls, there was one Chicago winner that we won't see in Hollywood. He's Keith Semple. He's the lead singer of the Chicago area band Seventh Heaven. Now, the Northern Ireland native earlier won the British talent contest Pop Stars. It's a contest similar to American Idol. It's better this way. Earlier today, Keith and his bandmates showed us why he did so well last summer auditioning for this new Idol season. Hey, I want to ask you. Unfortunately, an immigration snafu over Keith's visa forced the Idol producers to yank his golden ticket. I'm here on a work visa, and you have to be a permanent resident to enter the show, so I was, you know, trying frantically to get everything done in time. I think it was a postal error, which caused me. <laughs> postal errors weren't Keith's only roadblock. During his audition, the singer says Simon Cowell liked his voice, but was unhappy when he learned Keith had neglected to tell his bandmates he was auditioning for American Idol. But after the Irishman won his golden ticket, the Fox producers liked him so much, they included him in the commercial promoting tonight's episode and planned to film him telling the band. Yet even though Keith Semple isn't going to Hollywood with American Idol, he and Seventh Heaven are doing just fine. I'd say we're easily in the top 10 busiest bands in America. You know, we, we're, we've played near, close to 250 shows a year, so uh, and we're going to be on track to do that again this year. And uh, we're just going to be touring and trying to get our music out there as much as possible. Well, an interesting footnote, Seventh Heaven originally found Keith after he won Pop Stars in England on MySpace, truly a sign of the times. Also, we called Fox in 19 Productions about American Idol, canceling Keith's golden ticket, and they did decline to comment. Mm. So we did check with them. Fan certainly knows now. Yes, they certainly do. <laughs> they certainly do. I can't believe immigration officials are not influenced by American Can Idol. Can you believe it? Can you believe it? Some of the few people here. <laughs> You're starting to get